I don't know why I have to have all the vegetables. <laughs> I think it all goes back to when I was a young Mr. Rabbit, living way low down in the cedar swamp. My mommy told me, Puffy tails make little bunnies look jabby! <laughs> no more veggies for you, she said. <laughs> well, I say, Puffy tails are pretty! Isn't my tail pretty? <laughs> makes me so mad. Why does he have so many veggies? He has grown up way low down in the cedar swamp. See how he likes it down there. I was just starting to feel bad for that rabbit. <laughs> oh well. Ready guys? And one, two, here we go. <laughs> Back, but it's like I, I want him to fail. 
<laughs> well, I mean, I do want him to fail, but, uh, hmm, well, I mean, you know what I mean. Hmm. No? Well, you, well, it's just that, you know, that's, that's what a good villain does. <laughs> am I right or am I right? <laughs> You know, I'm going to take all of your veggies and what not and so forth and, and, and so on. Yeah. Well, anyway, I'm giving him another chance today to get those veggies back, but he and his little helpers are sure to fail. <laughs> they have to read the pictures of a song with low so and name the tune. Oh, 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 it's so hard. <laughs> I got an email from someone. Let's see who it is. Um, what we got here? Ah, oh, geez, not again. It's from old Mr. Rabbit. <sighs> Dear Mr. Holland Garcia, at least he didn't call me old this time. You think you are so cool with all of your veggies and whatnot. What is this guy's problem? Jeez. Okay. After your stinging defeat in my Big Fat Biscuit Challenge, oh, that was pretty harsh, I thought it only fair to give you another chance to get your veggies. Read the enclosed song, see attached, thank you, and if you can sing the pitches and name the song, well then, you're one step closer. Or are you? Ha 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 ha. Okay, I guess I'll just open this attachment. Let's see what we got here. Okay. All right, let's take a look here at what missed old Mr. Rabbit left us. Ah, okay, I see that the song starts with low so, goes up to do, then me, then so. Oh, that means my voice will start low and move up by, oh, these are all skips. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so, so do, sing that kids. So do. Um, I think do me sing that kids do me oh then we have me so sing that kids me so let's sing all four of those pitches ready here we go so do me so and does that so look I know it's part of it's cut off but this part does that so look like it's a short so or long yeah, it is long, and you can't see it, but I can see we need to hold it out for five entire beats. Let's sing that whole first phrase. Ready, here we go. So, do, mi, so. Hey, we made it to the first phrase. Okay, let's see what's happening here in the second. Oh, okay, this one starts on la. High la, not low la, okay. La, so, mi, do. Okay, it just moves down. La, so, mi, do, then. Oh, do, then goes up to mi. Mm. So down and then up. Let's try the second phrase. Ready, here you go. La, so, mi, do, one, mi. Oh, okay. All right, let's check out phrase three now. Oh, you know what? That's actually supposed to be a low. So let's pretend that there's a that there's a comma right there. So do. Okay. Oh, you know what? The first three pitches look exactly like the first three pitches in the first phrase. Oh. Mm -hmm. So do. Sing that. So do. Sing the next two. Do me. Go ahead. Do me. <gasps> but then we move down to re. Me re. Sing that. Me, Ray. All right, sing phrase three for me. Ready, here you go. So, do, me, Mmm, Okay, and phrase four. Oh, it starts with a mi, re, do. Sing that. Mi, re, do. Oh, and we skip down to la, do, la. Sing that, ready, go. Do, la. Oh, do, la. And then it end on the rest in tone, do. Sing the final three pitches, kids. Do, la, do. Sing the whole final phrase. 
mi re do la do. Sing the entire song from the top. Ready, here we go. So do mi so. Take a breath. La so mi do mi. So do mi re. Mi re do la do. Gosh, that sounds so familiar. <gasps> I got it. Do you got it? Let's say it together. One, two, three. Old Texas! Ha ha! Let's sing it with the words. We'll do it in canon. I'll sing first, you follow after me, and listen for that little voice that's gonna help you to guide to, to guide you through the song. Are you ready, friends? Okay. I'm going to leave. I'm going to Sun. Oh, oh, what was it? Did you see that fall into my pocket? What is this? Huh. Okay. I felt there's a note. There is a note attached to it. It says, oh, well, that's interesting. Well, I didn't think you'd do it, but you did. Guess who this is from? Hmm. Hmm. I'm a rabbit who keeps his word, and now you're a step closer. Don't lose that farmer's dairy key. Oh, come on. We gotta play I lost the farmer's dairy key. Uh. Okay, all right, well, let's go do it. Okay, here we are, kids. I've got the farmer's dairy key, as you can see. Now, we must win three out of five rounds if we want to get the next clue from old Mr. Rabbit to get my veggies back. Mmm, okay, here we go. Keep your eye on the box that has the key. I'm gonna flip each one over. We will sing the song while I mix up the boxes. I think I'll go ahead and start with the key underneath box number two. Are you ready, kids? Let me get my tuning fork. Bum, bum, and ready, here we go. I lost the farmer's dairy key. I'm in this lady's garden. Do, do, let me out. I'm in this lady's garden. Did you keep your eye on it? All right, we've got box number one, box number two, or box number three. I am guessing box number three. What do you think? Wish me luck. Okay, here's box number one. Okay. We're good so far. Number two. Ha ha ha! Yes! One point for us. In your face, Mr. Rabbit. Ha! Okay. All right, starting right there. Tune for again. Bum bum. And sing with me now, please. I lost the farmer's dairy key. I'm in this lady's garden. Do, do, let me out. I'm in this lady's garden. All right. I think, I don't know. Hmm. Box one, box two, box three. I'm thinking I actually lost track for real. I think it is in box number three again. What do you think? Okay, let's check. And... Oh, no! Why did I miss that? Okay, we're one for one. That's okay. It's all right. It's all right. Okay, just keep an eye on box number one. And ready, sing with me. I lost the farmer's dairy key. I'm in this lady's garden. Do, do. Let me out, I'm in this lady's garden. Okay, here we go. I, oh shoot, where is it? Box number three, right? Okay, let's check. 
Box number one. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Box number two. Oh, no. Oh, Mr. Rabbit. Oh, my God. Okay. Two for old Mr. Rabbit. One for us. It's okay. We're playing out of five. Here is the key. And ready, here we go. I lost the farmer's dairy key. I'm in this lady's garden. Oops. Redo. 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 And ready, don't mess it up, Nick. I lost the farmer's dairy key. I'm in this lady's garden. Do, do, let me out. I'm in this lady's garden. All right, I think I got it this time. I think it is box number three. Do you agree? Okay, let's check it. Box one. Yes. Box two. Yes! Box three. Yeah, baby. Oh, we are two for two. That means the next one wins. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is for the veggies kids don't let me down and ready here we go i lost the farmer's dairy key i'm in this lady's garden uh, do do let me out i'm in this lady's garden <sighs> okay i guess box number one so i'm gonna go in reverse order this time box three. Oh my gosh oh box two Ah, oh, yes! <laughs> we did it! Woohoo! Okay, time to call old Mr. Rabbit. Tell him the good news. <gasps> mm. <clears throat> Hello. <gasps> Mr. H.G., is that you? No. No, you couldn't have done it. You couldn't have done it. Did you do it? Did you do it? Hello. Yes, Mr. Old, old Mr. Rabbit. Mm-hmm. Guess what? Yep. We did it. <laughs> yes, well, well, fine. Sing my song and then I'll give you a clue, Buster. Goodbye. <laughs> well, you heard him, kids. We better sing a song. Pat your lap and sing. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in my garden and eating all my cabbage. Oh, I know. Copy what I do, kids. Ready? Here we go. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in my garden and eating all my cabbage. What word did we clap in phrase one? That's right, we clapped old. Ready one more time. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit. Stop. What word did we clap in phrase two? Got. Very good. Got is the strong beat of phrase two. Ready, here we go. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in my garden. What word was on the strong beat of phrase three? Jumping. Very good. Whole song now. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in my garden and eating all my cabbage. What word fell on the strong beat of phrase four? Eating. Very good. No, what was the first word of phrase one? Old, yeah, this also happens to be the strong beat. Ready, here we go. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit. What was the first word of phrase two? You've. And did you've land on the strong beat or somewhere else? It landed somewhere else. It landed before the strong beat. Ready, here we go. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in my garden. What was the first word of phrase three? Of, very good. Now, did of land on the strong beat or somewhere else? Of landed before the strong beat of phrase three. Sing a whole thing. Ready, here we go. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in my garden and eating all my cabbage. What was the first word of phrase four? And, <laughs> and did it land on the, Strong beat of phrase four or somewhere else? Somewhere else. It came before the strong beat of phrase four. So we have these pitches. We have these words that land before the strong beat of a phrase. Now, I'm pretty sure I know where old Mr. Rabbit's going with this and some of the questions he might ask. So I'm going to give you a little bit of information. When we have pitches that land before the strong beat of a phrase, musicians like to call them 
upbeats. Mm -hmm. Sometimes musicians like to call those pickups, but we're going to call them upbeats for today. Okay, we have upbeats. Wait, how many upbeats were in Old Mr. Rabbit? And in what phrases did they happen? Ooh. Ready, sing for me. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in my garden and eating all my cabbage. We had how many upbeats in Old Mr. Rabbit? Three. Very good. Was there an upbeat in phrase one? Nope. Was there an upbeat in phrase two? Yes. You've got a mighty habit. Was there an upbeat in phrase three? Yes. Of, oh my goodness, I can't believe I forgot. Of jumping in my garden. And what about, was there a, an upbeat in phrase four? Yes. And eating. Very good, kids. Okay. Are you ready? Let's call them, find out what these questions or whatever this challenge is going to be. Ringing. Hello. Guess who, you bad bunny? Well, let me think. Um, I just talked to my sister this morning. Oh, is this Roger from Valley Forge High School? No, Rabbit, that was meant to be rhetorical. It's Mr. H.G. Come on. Oh, for the love, I knew that. Boy, you really sure sounded like Roger from Valley Forge High School. Well, we did it. <laughs> the kids and I learned about upbeats, and we are ready for your challenging questions, for whatever you got for us. Oh, really? Well, I'll be the judge of that. Ha! Sing Do Do Pity My Case and find the first upbeat. <laughs> huh. Do Do Pity. Yeah, no problem. Let me just get my tuning fork. <laughs> Ready, kids, here we go. Do, do, pity my case. In some lady's garden, my clothes to wash when I get home. In some lady's garden. Did anything, kids, did anything happen before the strong beat of phrase one? Do, no, there didn't. Okay, what about phrase two? Do, do, pity my case. In some lady's garden. No, what about phrase three? My clothes. Oh, my came before the strong beat, kids, so that means it's okay. In phrase four, in some lady's garden. I think we got it, kids. All right, old Mr. Rabbit. <laughs> there was one upbeat in phrase three. The word was my. <laughs> Lucky guess. I see you need a challenge. Hmm, well, let me think. Oh, how about find the upbeats in Old Chisholm Trail? <laughs> yes! Ooh, ooh, Old Chisholm Trail. Kids, that's kind of a hard one. Now come along, kids, and listen. Okay, we can do it, we can do it, we can totally do it, we can do it. Mr. Rabbit, we can totally do that. Just give us a second to sing it, okay? All right. And ready, here we go. Now come along, kids, and listen to my tale. I'll tell you all my troubles on the old Chisholm Trail. Come a tie ya, yippee yippee yay, yippee yay. Come a tie ya, yippee yippee yay. All right, let's think of the three kids. Now come on, ah, oh, now came before the strong beat. Ah, uh, okay, phrase one has it. Now come along, kids, and listen to my tale. I'll tell you all my troubles. Ooh, I'll, yes, there's one in phrase two. I'll tell you all my troubles. Come a tie. Oh, yippee, yippee, yay, yippee, yay. Come a tie. Oh my gosh, there was an upbeat in every phrase. Old Mr. Rabbit, you still there? Okay, <laughs> I think we've got it. <laughs> this was too easy. <gasps> Upbeats in every phrase. Ah, yeah. <laughs> oh, spinach and squash. <sighs> That was supposed to be hard. Well, fine. Let me think. Last one. Oh, yes. Mush Tudin. Oh, devilishly difficult. Oh, that's a tricky one. 
Dum ba ba dum nine years ago, kids, I think you know this one. Then ready, here we go. Nine years ago, I was digging in the land with my brogues on my feet and my shovel in my hand. Mush toot and nanny a mush a rack fall a day, mush a rang fall dude and mush toot and nanny a. Okay, so phrase one, nine. Okay, so that nothing came before the strong beat there. So phrase one, no. Nine years ago, I was digging in the land with my brogues. Oh, with my. Oh, upbeat in phrase two. With my, was it upbeat? With my brogues on my feet and my shovel on my Mush tootin. Oh, mush, mush, mush is an upbeat. Okay, mush tootin in the mush a rangvold. Mush a rangvold. Ooh, mush a, mush a came before. Oh, wow. Okay, so there was an upbeat in phrase two, phrase three, phrase four. Oh, Mr. Rabbit. Oh, Mr. Rabbit. <laughs> Got it. There was an upbeat in phrase two, three, and four. Yes, uh-huh. <gasps> Not fair, you cheated! Hey, hey, you're the one who stole my vegetables. But you don't like those veggies the way I do! Oh, Jerry, call my therapist, tell him it's an emergency! <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, what about my vegetables? Ah, broccoli and Brussels sprouts. He did it again. Ugh. Well, kids, I guess that's bye for now. Well, hey, we tried. All that is all we can do. We can just try and get even trickier next time. I have an idea. I'll let you know on it a little bit later. But for your homework, I'm giving you a song to figure out the, if it has upbeats or not and where they are. So for your homework, please record yourself singing, I Lost a Farmer's Dairy Key. Tell me, phrase by phrase, if that phrase has an upbeat, and if so, what's the word that is the upbeat? Let's sing the song together, and this could even help you practice for your homework, okay? Bum bum, and ready, here we go. I lost the farmer's dairy key. Oh, you know what helps me when I do upbeats? Clapping the clapping the strong beat of the phrase. And ready, here we go. I lost the farmer's dairy key. I'm in this lady's garden. Do, do, let me out. I'm in this lady's garden. All right, practice singing that song. Sing that song for me. Tell me if it has upbeats and where they are. Drop that recording of yourself singing into your Seesaw folder, music folder in Seesaw. And I can't wait to see what you got. Well, goodbye, everyone. Have a super day today. See you, kids. Stay tuned. And then he sang much tuned in and he said, got it, like it was really easy. <laughs> Hurt my feelings. What should I do? Well, old Mr. Rabbit, I'd say the jig is up, baby. <gasps> no, it's you. Oh.